Hey, welcome back to YT Finance, and this is the channel where I went to business school so you didn't need to, and today we are talking about Super Microcomputer and how their share price could jump by another 60% according to professionals. With that being said, go ahead and annihilate that like button right now, subscribe if you are new, comment down below your personal price targets for Supermicro, and with that being said, let's get right into it. Supermicro Computer stock has had an amazing surge in their share price, and many professionals believe that this company still has a lot of room to grow. According to a Rosenblatt Securities analyst, they gave the company an even more bullish price target recently, which is igniting the share price once again. Super microcomputer shares have already jumped by around 715% over the last 12 months. But investors are still excited about this company because there is further upside still left in the stock. Super microcomputer is one of the most exciting AI or artificial intelligence stocks to buy right now, and here's why. The key to this company's success is that the company is growing their liquid cooling technology. And this allows Super Micro to ride the wave of artificial intelligence enthusiasm because they offer for liquid cooling to high-powered AI computers. Therefore, Supermicro is receiving a lot of demand for their cooling products and technology because many companies are going full throttle into artificial intelligence. Recently, the analyst increased his price target for Supermicro Computer, ticker symbol SMCI, to $1,300 per share from his original price target of $700 while maintaining his buy rating on this company and stock. This would imply approximately 62% upside from the current share price of around $803. But since this article was written, the share price actually dropped below $800, which in my opinion just gives investors a better buying opportunity. According to the analyst, he cites the following to substantiate and justify his price target increase, in which he says, and I quote, This increased price target is a reflection of the robust growth in artificial intelligence computing and of the company's strategic position within this rapidly evolving market. But not all analysts think the same about this company. For instance, a Wells Fargo analyst actually has a rating on this company, which is an equal weight rating, and they have a price target of around $960, which is well below that $1,300 price target from the former analyst. But the best thing about these price predictions is that their current share price is below both of these estimates, which means that this company still has large upside potential, even though it has surged recently. Many Wall Street analysts believe that the future of this company is very bright and that would include a Bank of America securities analyst, which has a buy rating on this company and a price target of $1,040. The current share price of SMCI stock is $787, and as you can see on screen here, the company has experienced a major pullback. But despite this, investors and analysts still believe that this company has a lot of future upside that it has left to achieve. The analyst justified his price target by saying this, We think this provider of server and storage solutions will be a beneficiary of AI-driven demand growth. We believe the market for AI servers is much larger than what Wall Street models for, which is very positive. This price target for over $1,000 for Supermicro is actually one of the more conservative price predictions. Because if the market for AI servers grows at an average annual rate of 50% over the next several years, then this company could explode in their share price even higher. Therefore, there is plenty more sales and earnings growth that this company could achieve going forward, so I am extremely excited. On top of that, this company is not that expensive. And here's what I mean by that. When we look at their price to sales ratio, they're hovering at around a ratio of 6 compared to 40 for NVIDIA. Therefore, this company is substantially cheaper than NVIDIA, which gives this company a lot of upside potential that it can grow into. Therefore, these price targets are extremely achievable. Now, don't get me wrong. This company's share price can be extremely volatile over the next few months, but overall, we should see a positive upside trajectory to this company's share price. That's why five major investors are betting big on this company. Like we said before, shares of Supermicro Computer, ticker symbol SMCI, are in the red again because they recently experienced a pullback. But I personally use this pullback to buy more of this company. And I bought a large sum of shares after Supermicro plunged by around 20% because remember, the best time to buy good companies is when they're falling in their share price. However, there is a problem here. The short interest of this company is rather high, and shorts haven't given up just yet. 
For context, shorts are people who are betting that this company's share price will fall. And in the last 30 days, the group has increased shares shorted by 12%. And that's why we are seeing a pullback in their current share price. But don't let this detract you from the stock. They are still a fundamentally solid company, and here's why. During quarter three, we saw 547 institutional filers hold this company in their investments. While in quarter four, that number increased up to 619 meaning that there is a significant interest in SMCI stock as an investment among institutions. However, at the same time, nine hedge funds actually pulled out of this company because the amount of hedge funds that owned this company was 145, but that then dropped to 136. So that is pretty interesting. But now let's talk about the major investors in this company, starting off with none other than the CEO and president of the company himself. The president of Supermicro has around 7.67 million shares which is very bullish when the CEO of the company really likes the company and doubles down by purchasing more and more stocks within the company. It's great to see the CEO of a company continuously buying stock in the company that they are managing, and this gives investors confidence. But we also see a large portion of institutional backing for this company as well. Take for instance BlackRock, ticker symbol BLK, which has 6.38 million shares, and they actually acquired 558,756 shares just during quarter four. Next up, we have Vanguard, which has 4.92 million shares of Supermicro, and they recently acquired 194,700 shares during quarter four. After that, we also see Disciplined Growth Investors, which owns 2.72 million shares, and they added 105,979 shares during quarter four. And then lastly, we see State Street, ticker symbol STT, which currently holds 1.84 million shares, and they recently acquired over 88,000 shares of Supermicro in the fourth quarter. In summary, this company looks like a phenomenal investment opportunity, so I'd love to hear your thoughts about this company down below in the comments. With that being said, go ahead and annihilate that like button right now, subscribe if you are new, and I will see you in the next YT video.